We're launching the visitmanchester.com website, which is um, the kind of public face of Marketing Manchester. It's, it's the website that we hope both visitors and people of Manchester will use as a resource to find out what is happening in this city, where to eat, uh, what's on. You know, it's like when you go to a city and it's really great if you know a new city that you've never been to, it's really great when you've got someone there who is cool as hell and knows where all the best places are and gets you to the front of the queues and the clubs and all that kind of stuff. That's what you want. So Fabric, imagine it's like a big listening machine that listens to all the conversation that is going on around the web about Manchester. So it collects things from Flickr and Twitter and, and Vimeo and all these kind of places. And it takes those and looks at the best bits and then delivers them through the site. So people can come, come on the site and get a real barometer of what is actually happening around Manchester. And then there are also the practical stuff. And we thought, well, when we're looking for a hotel, what do we do? I, I, what is a hotel near me now? We've got technology that we can do that. And so we've used that. Um, hotel near a venue, you know, the kind of stuff that is a bit painful at the moment. Yes, you can do it, but it's not as easy as it could be. And those are the areas that we focused on. We broke the idea of pages on the internet. And we think it's time to move away from the print paradigm. Um, and that's what we did. So the whole page is just like this never ending cascade of information that then becomes your journey through the site and the city and the region. It's the notion that uh, you can build uh, that kind of content by not only by hoovering up what's being said on Twitter and uh, uh, the, the photos being uh, posted on Flickr and so on, but also to offer through an API an opportunity for the digital community to engage with that site. I think it's a brilliant move. Uh, and I'm, uh, I don't know of other destination sites that do that. It's a high bar to, to meet. I think uh, key to doing that is going to be engaging the community inside Manchester as well as it becoming a, a, a destination of choice for people outside Manchester who want to know about Manchester before they visit. We will be flattered if uh, this is uh, repeated and copied for other cities. Uh, hopefully it can start across the region. So it started off in Manchester, but it, we're hopeful that this can spread out and that other agencies that promote the region can utilise it. But ultimately, if people want to flatter us by uh, reinterpreting it for them, then that would be a, a, an amazing thing. But it happened here first.